Well, the fate of the woman charged with intoxication manslaughter for a deadly wrong way crash is in the hands of the jury. Fox 26's Domily Keith is live in Montgomery County tonight where the jury deliberations are underway. Domily. Yeah, Melinda and Dom, the case went to the jury about an hour ago. Nicole Bacchus herself was the last person to take the stand. And of course, it was yesterday when she changed her plea to guilty. She pleaded, pleaded guilty to intoxication manslaughter. And of course, this happened, this accident, the fatal, awful accident happened back on in June of 2012. And that's when Nicole Bacchus allegedly went to a bar, consumed 21 alcoholic beverages. This is all caught on surveillance videotape, by the way. And that's how uh, prosecutors began closing arguments by pointing out every time Nicole Bacchus took a drink on that surveillance tape. And then you can see on that video, she goes out to her truck and she drives away. There's also videotape of her driving the wrong way on I-45 in North Montgomery County. And that's when she slams into another vehicle, uh, killing 19-year-old Nicole Adams and 18-year-old Travis Saunders. I spoke with Travis Saunders' dad. And he says anything but the maximum penalty will be injustice. So because Nicole Bacchus has already pleaded guilty, now this is the punishment phase, and the jury is deciding how they should sentence Bacchus. She could face anything from as little as two years probation all the way up to as much as 50 years in prison. Now, uh, Bacchus sobbed as she talked to the jury. She told jurors that she considered suicide after this fatal accident. She says she even wrote a suicide note because, in her words, quote, I don't deserve to live. I should have died that day in that crash. We will know uh, when jurors come back it, it just exactly how they're going to sentence Nicole Bacchus. But as of right now, they are still in deliberations. They've been deliberating since about 4 o'clock. We are live in Montgomery County. I'm Domilee Keith, Fox 26 News.